So one of the old adages of education is that it's the great equalizer. Education to me is the single most important experience that somebody can go through and really make a difference in how they go about their daily life. Initially, I was very surprised that the kinesiology department was housed within the Curry School of Education. Dr. Waltman came and lectured to one of the first days of my introduction to kinesiology class. He gave this wonderful lecture on childhood obesity and how we can work to change a lot of these chronic diseases that we see using exercise and nutrition. And that lecture really stuck with me. This is exactly what I want to do. In my first class, in the speech program, the thing that I remember from Dr. Hoffman, she would always say, a language is a difference, not a disorder. So I had a couple of internships and I started working with a little boy. He was in the special education program because they said that he pronounced things differently and I learned in phonetics that it wasn't really that he was pronouncing them incorrectly, it was just a different dialect. And so after working with him for six weeks, I saw this huge improvement. Curry helps us think outside of the box because you have to think of things for other people and you're not just thinking about yourself. Principals have a tremendous influence on the schools that they lead. We can do all the technical training we want, how to craft a discipline policy, how to craft some instructional coherence. That's great, but what does it mean to come up with a vision for where you want to take a school? And then how do you realize that vision? One of the things that drove me to enroll in this program here at Curry, specializing in ed leadership, is the idea that we're trying to prepare principals not only just to manage a school, but also how to lead one. My long-term career goal is to be able to better educate the medical community, how they can effectively use exercise as a form of medicine. I think, you know, we plant the seed with the knowledge and then the education is really what's holding those roots down and allowing the patients to flourish and see improvements in active daily living. And the job is tough. It is a really tough job to be a principal. I'm in this because I want to make a difference. Our central focus is to prepare leaders to go out there and lead schools that improve the lives of students. My dad had cancer. He was diagnosed with colon cancer when I was in seventh grade. My mom is a single mom. She is like my best friend. She wants a better life for her children than she had. And it's really hard for her to be able to send us to school. When I was awarded the Asabi Johnson Scholarship, I remember calling my mom and we just cried. So I'm extremely thankful for the Curry School Foundation and their generous donors. And without their generosity, I would probably not have these experiences who have shaped me into the clinician that I want to be in the future. Curry kind of gave me that niche that I've been looking for. I was a recipient of the Walter Campbell Scholarship in Educational Administration. So I'm very thankful to the foundation and its donors for supporting students here at Curry. And so I think about it often. Every day, I'm just so thankful that I'm still here because I'm able to continue my education. I think that philanthropy is really important in giving back, especially because I know that I wouldn't be here without all the people that helped me. I recently gave a presentation to a group of visiting Chinese school administrators. And so the research that we do here at Curry is actively influencing the leaders that are in schools in countries around the world. You know, when we do research and when we teach, sometimes we think it just stays in a classroom or it just stays in a research lab. The effect cascades around uh, places that you would have never guessed. And I think that's why Curry is special because it fosters that same sense of curiosity and wanting to change the world in every single one of its students. Because there are very generous people out there that give their money, that check turns into experiences. And I have been so fortunate to have been a recipient of those funds to help me craft an experience that's going to make a difference in the lives of principals, teachers, and students in schools around the world. That just is something that it's hard to put into words.